One of the things that martial art has taught me is consistency. How to keep on doing the same thing repetitively till the time you get it perfect. The shot, the landing, understanding the body, the movement. And I feel like there's a lot of precision in the sport and it has helped me bring focus in my life, not just in the sport, but also in my professional and personal life. There's a certain peace that reputation brings. It gives me a sense of strength. And that is something I've also learned from Zab School. Business education is changing, and the most innovative way to teach the leaders of tomorrow is to ensure that the technology of today supports their growth and development. Employers are looking for a diverse set of skills in new graduates. Obviously, they're looking for graduates that have the technical skills and the knowledge that they can hit the ground running in those organizations. But equally important for employers is to make sure they hire people that have the core skills they need to be able to communicate all of the great knowledge and skills that they have. We can have the best technical strategy, but you have humans that implement that strategy. And so the human element, the critical thinking, the ethical decision-making, the values that really drive an organization, that's uniquely human. The advisory boards are really the ones who challenged us to think about how can we ensure that not only are we giving the great technical skills, but to ensure that we're also creating future leaders that can communicate well, that can critically think, and that are emotionally intelligent. The Core Skills Lab uses AI in a lot of different ways to help our students develop their skills, from engaging with avatars and practicing having difficult conversation with employees, to giving a big presentation, and even engaging with AI to help develop their answers to interview questions, both technical and behavioral. It really provides a safe space for our students to practice and fail and grow. Hello, Ishita. What's this meeting about? I'm busy. Hi, Rob. This is this meeting is about you. One of the things that Core Skills Lab provides is having critical conversation. So, practicing a salary negotiation or trying to understand some critical situation or discussion that you might not be comfortable having in real life. So, you can just try to understand how to roll that conversation, how to get started with it. I hope you all are doing good today. I'll we have an option where we device. can upload our presentations or our job descriptions and it helps the AI to generate questions. The AI reads that how distracted do I get if something is moving in front of me? My eye contact, am I looking towards the left more or the right more? It shows me the balance about it. The feedback that the artificial intelligence provides is both narrative and quantitative. And so the narrative is really helping the student think more deeply about the answer that they gave and the approach that they took. But the quantitative is giving them a score. And it's giving them a score overall, but it's also giving them a score around eye contact and behavioral traits. But what's critically important about that feedback is it's a developmental tool and students can actually monitor their progress and see their growth. I had a serious issue having a fast pace in speaking, which didn't really help me to connect with the person I'm talking to. And the second thing was stage fear. Talking in front of a large amount of people was something I used to get conscious about. So I feel like it has multiple zones that you can explore yourself in and see what your weaknesses and strengths are and try working on it. The Core Skills Lab complements human coaching and advisement because it's a tool. It's not meant to replace that human element. The one commonality that I see is the confidence that it builds. So whether you're a first year student here at Zarb or you're in our executive MBA program, we want to make sure that we're helping you develop the confidence you need to achieve the goals that you've set for yourself. I feel like all the practice that I did during my education and my first year here at Hofstra, it's paying off right now. The communication skills, the connect that I have with my bosses and the seniors, the ability to ask questions, to learn new things. 
after a certain time you have to start doing things on your own. So I feel like finding that bridge between academics and the professional front is a very personal thing to do. The technology in the core skills lab bridges the gap.